uh, I think Asian people are still not quite represented according to what the demographics are. And, uh, and unfortunately, I think men, male actors bear the brunt of it. You know, as, as women, um, as Asian women, we seem to have gotten more breaks than Asian men. I think simply because we're more sort of objectified. Um, and, and there's really been a lack of representation for male romantic leads as Asian Americans. Um, I really feel like that ceiling has not been broken yet. And that's something that we really need to work on. Asian American men are just not thought of as sexy or strong or masculine. Um, people like Steve Harvey, I don't know if you guys are even familiar with him, you know, are, are making fun of Asian Americans not being desirable. That's one page too. Excuse me. Do you like Asian men? No. Thank you. I mean, and these are things that really seep into the heads of society. When, when statements like that are made, it becomes reality. Um, and, and we in Hollywood, what we need to do is we really need to break that stereotype. Um, and, and unfortunately, there just has not been any roles that, uh, that, that show Asian Americans in very masculine, sexy roles. So of course, if they're not shown that way in television and film, people are not going to start thinking that way. Um, you know, it's, it's really one of the responsibilities that we have in this business um, to, to sort of break those kind of stereotypes and, 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 um, and, and fight back against like the Steve Harveys of the world. So I think what the, the, the message for the next generation is, is to get involved, to not sit back and let things happen to you, but really take the initiative, write um, about things that are bothering you, go and support Asian American uh, films or, or be a part of, an active part of this society. Otherwise, you know, you're constantly going to be the victim. You know, be that person who's not afraid to be in the arena getting the dirt on your face. Don't just sit back and be a critic, because that's so easy. That's so easy to just sit back and be a critic or be a victim, but to be the person in the arena getting dirt on your face, going through the battle, is what we need to do. You know, there's a, the, the, the whole movement for African Americans, you know, um, didn't come around because people were sitting on their butts crying about it. You know, if you want your voice heard, do something about it. Be proactive.